hey guys welcome back to my channel i hope you're all doing well happy thanksgiving i am filming this video on thanksgiving day while making thanksgiving dinner for my family this is my third time attempting to fill this video um fill <laughs> oh gosh this is my third attempt to film this review i've been having such a hard time with filming this either there's people outside um cleaning or there's a lot more going on there's always some distractions so I had to hold off in filming this or the quality wasn't that great. So, hey, we're trying. Okay, we're new to YouTube. We're learning. We're growing. So I want to thank all of you who have subscribed so far. I truly appreciate that you guys enjoy my content. You like my videos. So please don't forget to thumbs up every time you watch. Please don't forget to like, share, you know, and have your friends and family subscribe. You know, I'm looking forward to doing my first giveaway once we hit 100 subscribers. Not 1,000, just 100 people. <laughs> 100 subscribers, I will do my first giveaway. But with that said, guys, I don't want to ramble too much. I want to thank you all for being on here. If, you're, if this is your first time on my channel, my name is Annie. I have to do a better job of introducing myself because I often forget. Um, if you're new to my channel, thank you so much for stopping by. On this channel, we talk mostly about fragrances. If that is your thing, please don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Don't forget to like this video or watch my other videos. It really helps my channel grow, and I truly, truly appreciate that. Okay? So without further ado, let's jump into KLE Vanilla 28. I am so excited to be reviewing this fragrance for you guys. I've heard so many great things on YouTube. When I was searching for vanilla fragrances to buy, there were a few on my list, but I had to get my hands on this fragrance. I am told this is an oriental fragrance, so I don't have anything Middle Eastern oriental in my um, collection at the moment. So I have been buying a little bit of um, KLE fragrances to add to my collection. So, I have KLE, I do have Amber, um, Invite Only, uh, Amber 23, I believe. And then I'm, I got the pink one, the Sweet Diamond Pink Pepper coming in the middle, that is uh, number 25. So, this is the three I have, but for now, this will do. Um, I'm spending too much, so I need to cut down and just use this up and, you know, just do, you know, update reviews on them to see how I'm, if I'm still liking them, not still liking them. So, with that said, guys, uh, this is definitely YouTube made me buy it. Every Nicole TV was talking about this. There was other YouTubers I watched reviews on that talked about this fragrance. They have nothing but great things to say. I get the hype. Um, it's a great fragrance to layer and mix with other fragrances in your collection that you want to, you want, you know, you don't like or just want to add more vanilla or more sweetness to them, okay? So, let's talk about the packaging. I truly love the KLE packaging. Um... For starters, I love their box. This is just a beautiful, sturdy box, okay? You can truly keep this if you want to. I love this metallic amber um, or gold bronzy. Oh, my gosh. I can't think. I love this metallic bronze, um, you know, print right here. It's really beautiful. I also love that KLA puts their top notes. I'll bring that closer so you can see. They have their top notes um, of fragrances on the back of the box to really help you identify what you're um sniffing but then this is just a quick click this is just a, a classic beautiful packaging the bottle is heavy i love the trademark design of the packaging i love the gold the little diamond top it's just a beautiful beautiful design the one downside to all of the kle fragrances and you see fragrances packaging that i don't like is that it does hang on to a lot of prints i'm not sure if you guys can see this but there's so many thumb prints on here and another cool thing that I want to highlight is that this is Vanilla 28. A lot of the KLE fragrances have a number at the end. My understanding is that is due to the number of time it took them to either produce the final product. So this is Vanilla 28. So it took 28 attempts to make this masterpiece, I will call it. It's beautiful. I love the juice inside. It's just amazing. Hey guys, as I was editing, I realized that I forgot to tell you guys what the notes are. So I'm going to do it right here and I'm going to insert it into the video. So the top notes are vanilla orchid and jasmine. The heart notes are brown sugar and tonka bean. And the dry down is bullwood and patchouli. So this is a great fragrance. It is sexy. It's beautiful. One that I would truly, truly recommend to anybody. Um, please don't forget to grab it. Get your hands on it. And let me know how you feel about it. So in case I forgot to mention this earlier, let's talk about the sizing. Okay, so this is the... 100 ml, so 3.4 fluid ounces. It goes for about $138. I picked this up from the KLE website directly. It was sold out of Sephora, so I couldn't get the minis to try. 
So I looked at the Kelly website, it was sold out there as well, but then I kept checking both sides and the um, Kelly website did have the, the full size, so I just picked it up. Now the reviews were great. This is one thing I would say, this is a safe wine buy. Anybody who like vanilla scents will definitely love this. It's more, it's universal, it's universally loved. I think it's mass appealing is what I'm trying to say. So if you're hesitant, I wouldn't be. I would recommend this 10 out of 10, pick it up, add it to your collection, layer it with other Kelly fragrances layer it with other fragrances in your collection that you want to add a sweet note or a vanilla note to it it's just a really really beautiful uh, scent that i really enjoy so it is delicious it is really sexy it's also light and youthful um so i think a teenager could wear it um just depend um the smell when you first spray out the bottle guys i have to be honest um there is a um alcoholic scent to it that just comes up but it lasts for about 60 seconds and then it vanishes and then you pick up the sugar, the vanilla notes um, from the scent, from the bottle. So it's just a great, great, really great, great scent. I have it sprayed on my arm so I can like um, smell it and tell you, sniff it. So the first couple of notes, so when you first spray, like I said, you get that alcoholic scent that dies within 20 seconds to 60 seconds. But then once it dries down, that's when the real magic happens. Um, you get the brown sugar you get the patchouli the caramel um it's a bit spicy but it's so delicious i literally layer this with any fragrance in my collection because it smells so divine it's a beautiful beautiful fragrance i would add this i haven't tried this yet but i might add this with my baccarat rouge 540 to see how they pair together so i think it might be a great combination because baccarat rouge 540 it's very soft and kind of like skin like to me and people have to come close to you to pick it up you know, I wore that. I wore Baccarat Rouge to a Thanksgiving dinner um, last week, and a lot of people would come. Like they were, they couldn't stop touching me, and it made me a little weird. <laughs> like I felt a little weird, but it was just beautiful. And I was like, okay, maybe they don't. They're trying to figure out what I'm wearing, but I love this. So I also layered this with my Leather Jardin from Zara because that's a very that Leather Jardin fragrance has a very leather, strong leather scent. So this helps soften it up a bit and give it some sweetness. So I love that. I also I've also layered this with my um Angel Nova um what's it called Terry Mogla Angel Nova, which I don't I don't like. It's very fragrancy, um not fragrance. It's very synthetic. The Angel Nova. So I add this to soften it up, which I really like. I like the combination. Once I do that, I can find it more tolerable um to my nose. So guys, I absolutely love this fragrance. It's beautiful. Um, to me, it lasts on my skin about five hours. When I spray it on my clothes, I get an extra longevity. So maybe I could say five to eight hours on my clothes because I can still smell it. So it will stay cold longer. But it's just beautiful. Um, you know, I pour it all over my body. Um, it's just fantastic. I would totally recommend this. If I see the hype and I bought into the hype and I will tell you, I would hype it up for you as well because it's great. Any no step smells this with one in your collection. So I would say it's a safe one buy. I believe I mentioned that earlier. Um, it's, I believe it's also something that anybody would truly, truly love. So if you are interested and been thinking about it, don't hesitate. Go pick it up. You will thank me later. This is a 10 out of 10 in my opinion. And I love it. I know it doesn't look like I've worn it as much, but let's do it like this. So that's how much I've won from this fragrance. I do two sprays to work um, because I don't want to like, you know, kill everybody with my fragrance. <laughs> So I do two sprays, but it is it, still pretty full. And I do have a pretty decent um, perfume collection, so I do rotate. But I'm trying to do a new trend where I would wear one fragrance every week so I can try to put more dent into my fragrances. So starting on Monday, I work Sunday through Thursday. So starting on Sunday, I will totally wear just this um, for the whole week. And then the next week, I'll rotate with something else. But this is an amazing fragrance. I would truly recommend it. Um, anybody that's interested in picking up, please go ahead. And that's all for this review, guys. If you've tried Kelly fragrances, you have any suggestions or, you know, you want to leave your thoughts on this fragrance, please do that in the comment below. Let's continue the conversation there. I'm really looking forward to, um, chatting with you guys. So thank you if you've made it this far. I truly appreciate you for taking the time to watch my videos. It means the world to me. Don't forget to like, um, don't forget to subscribe and I will see you all in my next video. Bye guys.